simply learn. Your pace, your place. Module 1C, Part 2, Debt and Equity Structures. Introduction. Hello and welcome to Module 1C, Part 2 of the Financial Modeling course by Simply Learn. This lesson is about debt and equity structures in M&A deals. When an M&A deal happens, the acquiring company must find a way to fund the acquisition. Very few companies can or would finance the acquisition with their own funds or cash because this is both cash demanding and because this is a poor use of cash. We will see what are the various funding options and the types of financial deals and products that usually play an important role in M&A deals. We will put everything together by looking at a full company valuation model. Now let's move on to our agenda. Agenda. We will start our presentation by taking a look at the various ways a company can finance the acquisition of another company. Besides auto financing involving cash, we will see that acquisitions rely on two different types of instruments, which are debt and equity. We will see the main characteristics of both financing models and look at a special type of acquisition called leveraged buyout. In our next section, we will take a look at the various types of M&A deals and discuss hybrid financing structure and the use of derivative instruments like options and warrants. We will provide with a concrete valuation example of those derivative instruments by looking at the valuation of warrants. The following section will focus on one important aspect of M&A deals, which is the change in ownership following a merger or acquisition. One aspect of capital structure change is what is called dilution, which is a reduction in shareholders' ownership following a capital increase used to finance an acquisition. Accretion, on the other side, is the value created by the merger and that comes as a compensation to shareholders for the reduction in their percentage ownership of the combined company. Let's get started with the presentation on our next slide. Financing Acquisition Deals One of the ways a company can finance the acquisition of another company is by borrowing money, usually debt instruments. Debt-based financing is another type of financing that is based on using debt in order to acquire the target companies. There are two different ways a company can use debt to 